What's up, YouTube? Um, we're back over here fixing my car again. I, see, I have a bunch of oil spots on my, you know, so I had to fix that. And found out, big shout out to 06 WX dude. A big, big shout out. Found out, uh, I kept seeing them on 04 and then 02 um, until he did an 06, which is the same year as mine. Uh, took the liberty of taking off the intercooler, uh, the blow-off valve pipe, also the whole thing, um, throttle body, boom. Uh, I'm not gonna get any gaskets right now because I don't have the time to go up over there. And then right here is where the pipe connects to the block. Right there is the PCV. Well, actually, it's the whole PCV valve line. Um, this is the part number right here. I'm gonna show you exactly how my old one just cracked. So the bottom, this is the top part of the one that connects to the block. Let me see if it can. Uh, it, it just cracked. It was cracked like from the bottom. Look, look how crunchy. Everything just broke off. Like I can't even flex it. Everything pieces. It was it was nasty, and I still need to take off this one piece. And then this is the new one. Look how flexible that is. I'm not gonna flex it. That's too much because I don't want to break it. But that's the whole the whole piece right there. I've actually it's been like an hour, so I'm gonna try to finish this as soon as possible. And I'll show you when I have everything plugged in. Um, but right now this piece right here is gonna be my freaking demise, and it's always the one little f fucking piece. All right, so I'll be right back, okay? All right, so I'm in the process of putting everything back together. Um, it was actually very simple to put back on. Let's see, it's brand new. I didn't even show you the sensor. Look, just look how nasty that was. Can you see that? It was disgusting. And look, it's supposed to be flexible. It's crunches. So I replaced everything. Just for safekeeping, there was a little bit of oil in here, cleaned it, but I believe that was because of the PCV valve. There's no oil in my turbo, so that's a great sign. I still don't know what turbo I have, but whatever, I'll find out when I get it tuned. Put the blow off ba uh, bypass valve back on, I'm about to put the intercooler back on, and we'll give it a start up in a few moments, okay? And then just got to clamp that and clamp this one right there, right there. This goes to the bypass valve. Um, next installed, it's going to be, uh, I'm planning on putting gauges on my car. Um, so I can plug that hole over there with an actual sensor and then a uh, boost gauge. So it'll be right here through, through this, this hose. It's super simple. So yeah we'll be right back with the actual startup see if it goes actually there was a pool of oil right there right down the middle right there so it'll be another like 10 minutes i'll be right back so we're gonna go start her up Ugh. Not gonna lie, it, feels, it sounds a lot smoother. Let's see. Whoa. It's actually really responsive now. Big shout out to 06 WRX dude. I will have his link to his channel. No, he does not know who the hell I am, but I found this out because of him. So thank you. Go subscribe down below, leave a comment, and leave a like. 
and uh, go check his channel out. It's pretty cool, actually. I like his content. So, I, I, again, he has no idea who the hell I am. So, peace out.